What's up guys, welcome back to another video. And today we are going to be, because we hit 100 subscribers, um, somebody commented on our post that we should do Lego tips. So today we are going to do a video where we're gonna show you guys 15, 15 tips about Legos. So um, first up, um, this is the first one. If you have four of these Legos, these Lego priors, um, or if you have more, you just need at least four. Um, you can make it as big as you want, but then you can make like a little fidget toy. Okay. But yeah, so that's our first one. You can make a little fidget toy with four of these prior Legos if you have extras. And our second one, if you have a bush that looks like this, you can put some flowers on it if you have them. Or some green flowers to make it look like leaves, just like that. And then you have a bush with some flowers on it. If you have um, one of these like thingies and like one of these door frames, you can put it on into each other and it will make like a little mini jail cell for Lego prisoners if they're bad. And if you have some, um, this is number four. If you have some brown pieces, um, you can put them all together and then make a tree if you have some leaves too. So then a tree. And then if you have some like flooring, you can, this is an illegal building technique, but you can put, you can wedge it into there and put something on it. And then you can like put things on here and stuff without having any building blocks. Okay, so if you guys say have like something like a pole, like it doesn't have to be exactly this, but a pole, and then some flags, and then some flags. You can either put them together or have them separate. You could put them on the pole, like this. And if you have even more, connect them. You can connect them with another pole, but this time we use brown, but you can use a different color. We connected it. We put one on top of that, like that. But it has to be a flag touching it or else it wouldn't connect. It would just be like this. You have to have a flag at least like touching it like that. And then you can put other kinds of flags on top of it. Like, oh, like that. And you can have a big flag. Like that, giant flag. That's kind of crooked because it's broken. And number seven, if you have one of these pieces right here, and then one of these pieces right here, you can connect them together, and then and then one of them will like move, and then you can put something on it, and then it can move and function without you moving it. And then for this one? Yeah. Okay. And then here's another one. Um, this is, this is, uh, I think, another this illegal... This is a really useful one. This is another illegal building technique. It could break it. But if you have, like, pieces, like, these two pieces, like, something, like, slanted, like, kind of, like, cheese. Well, some cheese. It doesn't have to be exactly this. It could be, uh, two by one. 
No, it has to be those. Oh, it does? Okay. And then you could put it in. In the corners? Yeah, in the corners, like. One in the top, like, right, like and that, then the other in the bottom left. Like that. So they have to be opposites. And then, like, that. So yeah. you have it like exactly this. Exactly like that. Exactly like it. And then you can have this other one and put it on, like, let's see. Um, like that. And then both sides you can put on it. Yeah, and then it just looks like both sides. Yeah. You can squeeze down a lot. So it's pretty cool. It's really useful. It's hard to take out if you want to take it out. Okay, and you can do that, but it is a legal building technique because oh, yep. it can break the blocks, like just what happened. Because brown is like one of the most fragile or fragile um, Lego blocks, so it does break very easily. Um, where's the that one? So it just broke. As you can tell, it broke. And this is the other piece. It broke, which is kind of annoying. But so that's how you know not to use, that's another thing, not to use, not to like pry stuff inside of um, brown blocks. It's another one, don't do that or else and it'll number break. Eight, this Be is, very sad. Number eight, this is probably the coolest one here. And this took, this is probably the coolest one. And this took me about half an hour to make it. So if you have any of these, you can, make them and this will make a small portion of a circle if you have a bunch of those and then using these two by one bricks you, you can make a circle and it took me a really long time to make it but then you have a circle and yeah Got her out. All right. and also one thing guys um thank you so much for your support guys um, since we made our last video, which was only five days ago, when we hit 100 subs, um, now we're already at 120 subs, 20 more subs since we made that video. So that's, we're just getting so fast. Thank you guys so much. All right, I'll do, what is this, number nine? Yeah. So this is number nine. I finally remembered to say the numbers. So if you have this kind of piece right here that has kind of like, it's, here's a better... If it's like that, you kind of can see like there's a little hole in it, kind of. It's not like a normal Lego. And then you have, well, if you have this thing extended, you can put a door in there and mm -hmm. slide it. And if you also have, and you can also put this, like a glass in there, you can have two and it'll be like a sliding door. Mm -hmm. You can't really see it. I don't know if you could, it's like this. But if you have, if you have this, and then another one on top, it could be a sliding door and it wouldn't just fall out. So it could be a sliding door that wouldn't just fall out easily, like that. If you have two of them and have one on bottom, one on top. But we d we didn't bring in like this one on top. Oh, 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 you did. Like. Actually, you guys, like we have that. 14. Sorry, we have 14. Um, like this. We have 14, sorry. It's just not connected, so it's hard. Like that, though. Something like that. But once you connect it to, like, buildings, it will work. So that's number nine. And number ten, if you have a chest like this, you can put all your treasures in there. Like, all your gold, your money. You can just put it right in there your diamonds you can just put all those in there and you will have a chest with all your treasures so that's number 10. Is this number 11? Mm -hmm. what no, no just so this is number 11? Mm -hmm. this is number 11. so if you have some either like a pole but we have this we, and since this doesn't really connect onto anything, use this piece right there. We put this in here, and boom, got a pole. And if you have any of these pieces, 
If anyone knows what this is, you can comment on what it is because I have no clue what it's called. But I guess an umbrella top. And if you put this on like so, like that, you got an umbrella. It does not have to be specifically, ow, this pole and this piece. But if you have any other pole, like say you have this pole with the flag, this gray one, or this brown one, it works just a pole. You just need a pole and then this umbrella top and then boom. You got an umbrella for the beach. If you want to go to the beach anytime soon in the Legos. So, number 11, beach. Number 12, if you're building something like a building, I didn't get a bunch of pieces up here, but say these are the walls and then this is the roof. It can be hard to take the roof off. So, if you have um, some of these, like things it, it doesn't have to be white just any color and attach them to the walls you can put it on and attach them to the roof and then the roof can come off that easily so that's another useful one that's number 12. we have two more to go this is number 13. Okay, so the mark number 13. Wait, no, that's number, wait. Number. That's, the last one was number 13. This is number 14, and oh, this is okay. the last one. This is number 14. So say you have something like, I think this piece some, is cracking. Some gray pieces. Yeah, like say you have like a gray piece like this and another gray piece. You can connect it and then put it in your Lego city and you have like a little rock. And you can do another one, which I kind of like this way better. So if you have this this piece right here, it has studs on the top and a piece where you can connect it to like platforms. If you have another piece that's just like a normal piece, connect platform and then studs on the top like that. You can connect these two right there and you have a rock or, or if you have another piece, another kind of piece like this, it's like a slope you put it on to your lock rock you have it's a bigger rock so you can, and then you can connect these two rocks and have a giant weird rock or you can just have them separated and that's number 14 mm -hmm. that this is number last 14 one. last one you can make cool rocks or you can make them even bigger or if you already have the rock mold that lego originally made you can also use that just for rocks and put stuff inside we should bring that for 15. You can open up the rock and put stuff inside, just like the chest, like valuables. But this, you can make rocks, it doesn't have to be exactly the same, but you can make rocks way bigger than this. So that's number 14, last one. And so yeah, and one thing that I wanna tell you guys, since we made that pickleball video, um, we have gained 48 subscribers since that video, which is insane. So um, thank you guys for all your support. We are seven likes away from 500 likes on this channel. Half a thousand oh. likes. So, um, seven more likes, guys. And, um, yeah, thank you guys for watching this video. I hope it helped you guys, um, at least one of them. And, um, you can comment somewhere, um, on our community mm -hmm. posts or on our shorts. Um, which one was your favorite one or which one was most useful um so yeah uh thank you guys for watching hope you liked it make sure to like and subscribe it's where the mattress is moving um bye guys bye